Good morning. Um, my name is Carrie. Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, I am traveling around Nepal for a month. I'm currently in Pokhara. I'm headed to the town of Chatawan. I believe is how you say it. Uh, this morning, it's a national park, about five, six hour bus ride from here. We need to be at the bus station by 7.30, uh, departs. Hopefully it's not as bad in Bumpy Road as it was to get to Bogra. Should be a good adventure. We made it to the bus park. Now we just have to figure out which bus is ours. Shouldn't be too hard. It's called the blue sky. We made it to the right bus, I believe. Other people think we're going to the right place, so that's good. A little different seating arrangements. Hopefully it won't be too bumpy. Yeah. I did skip breakfast today though. Off to channel one. Look beyond the buildings. Okay, it's kind of funny. Hopefully you can hear me. It is so bumpy of a ride again today. It's actually the same route that we took yesterday, or the other day from um, Bampur to Pokhara. We have to go all the way back there and then we cut off um, instead of going back to Kathmandu. But my watch just buzzed me saying I just hit my new stepping record because <laughs> it thinks I guess we're walking. I don't know why, but I thought it was kind of funny. I'm um, glad I skipped bre breakfast. Um, yeah, right now it's a pretty calm area of the road, actually. Yeah. right now the hotel we're gonna um, set up our next couple days here going on some type of safaris I definitely want to do community and probably the Jeep safari so this whole is Chiton okay so in this in, in Chiton we are doing those activities like walking from half day four days still you can do long time okay wow. And the next one is zip safari in the park. And the next one we can do is canoeing. We can do one hour. This is our hotel for this evening. Hotel National Park. Isn't that pretty? This was $33 for three nights. Let me turn this. Hold on. Okay. Very excited. We booked with them a two days of safari. So tomorrow it is a hour canoe ride and an hour canoe ride, four hour walking through the national park and then a four hour Jeep ride. And then the next day is gonna be an all day walking through a different part of the park. Cross your fingers we see a tiger, but anything would be cool. There's a rhino over there. You probably can't see it in the camera. But, but you see rhino, but you didn't see crocodile? Just close. <laughs> you see? Did you see crocodile? No. Oh. <laughs> I see you. There's a so one, two, three, four. Oh, yeah. Wow. So are humongous. And we're going to go canoeing in that river. It's been an interesting, fun day, I must admit. The bus ride really wasn't as bad as it was 
coming from Benpur to Pokhara. I'm not really sure why. Maybe it's because I sat closer to the front this time. Um, but yeah, bus ride isn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. And it was only 700 which is, I think, like $7. So awesome. Yeah. I'm at my hotel right now. I'm staying at Hotel National Park in the town that's closest to the park entrance. Um, there's a safari here, um, a nature reserve that we're going to go explore tomorrow. Um, yeah, this is my view from my laptop. There's like a shared balcony. Isn't that pretty? So this hotel has been amazing already. I've only been here for maybe five hours, um, but when I got here, he met me at the bus stop and drove me right to the hotel. He showed me my room. He, um, afterwards, like I, he's like, go rest, come back when you're ready to check in. And then um, he told me about the park and all the options that we have available. So there's tons of like different options that you can do. So it's not a package for everyone. You get to like customize your, your adventure. So, I'm very excited. Today, actually, after that, um, I had a small snack, and then he took me to the river to watch the sunset. And I guess he does that for every guest. He's there every single day. Uh, so, I saw a croc two different types of crocodiles, and we saw a rhino, a wild rhino. So, pretty amazing, eh? But yeah, it's a beautiful day. It's probably in the 80s again today. It's not as cool here at night, uh, but there's no humidity in the air. It's very nice. Good morning. We're outside our hotel getting ready to go on a safari this morning. Uh, we leave at 7 o'clock, so I'm enjoying some black coffee. Oh, my God, I don't want to go by myself. I think tomorrow I have to do it all by myself. Just a full day walk, but in a different area. Yeah. 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 <laughs> it's been a long time since I've been in the back of a truck. <laughs> You guys are ready for an hour canoe ride in a little river for crocodiles. We are. What is the name of this river? This river name is a Budi Rapati. I cannot say that. Dungre. 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 Dungre River. Oh, that's a long nose one. They're so interesting looking. Somebody, this is a little bit of that. We just finished our canoe ride and we didn't get eaten by any crocodiles. It was amazing and magical. Almost felt like a Disney World ride or something. That's how amazing that was. 
It's a silk cotton tree. The canoe is made by this tree. The canoe is made by that tree. So, <clears throat> in here, uh, during uh, walking time, we have to be careful with a uh, few animals. There are most aggressive animals. It's rhino, bear, tiger. These are the most uh, uh, aggressive animals, as well as an uh, elephant. So, during our walk, we walk very slow, quite uh, carefully, and more uh, actively. We have to walk because this is the jungle. Mm -hmm. So, uh, one of most aggressive animals is rhino. So, during our walk, if we have a sort of situation with the rhino, if in case rhino try to follow us to attack, then we have to look easy tree and climb off. Okay. If we are in forest, if uh, there is a easy tree nearby you, you just look easy tree and climb up okay. about six feet high. Mm -hmm. So, uh, if there is a really big tree, if you cannot climb, mm -hmm. then just go behind the tree, mm -hmm. opposite side of the rhino. Yeah. And sometimes we will be walking open area where are the no tree, no bush, nothing to hide. At uh, that situation, if in case rhino follow us to attack, then we have to run, but not uh, straight. We have to run long uh, zigzag exactly. because rhino, their eyesight is very poor, okay. but they smell very good and they hear very good. Okay. So when they follow us, they follow by smelling and hearing. So they are very big animals. Uh, they are. Uh, uh, second largest animals of the land after the elephants it is very difficult to run right away for them yeah. so that we have time to go away if we run in zigzag okay. that's a rhino okay and don't be worried this is just for <laughs> some time uh -huh. just, just in case yeah <clears throat> and another aggressive animals is the bear so during our walk we have a black bear it is also called sloth bear when they stand up same like a human size so they are also quite aggressive so during our walk if we see bear we have to be together and uh, look if in case bear try to come to us then we have to be together and make a noise okay. like a clapping mm -hmm. or shouting or bang in the ground so that bear go away okay okay and uh, another is a tiger so everyone they used to say oh my god tiger is very dangerous animals they kill you this and that but we born here, we grow up here. In our experience, they are very gentle and handsome animals. The tiger, as soon as they see human, uh, they go away. Yeah. As soon as they know human around them, they try to hide. That's the nature of tiger. Yeah. So, of course, they are aggressive uh, during our walk. If in case, if we be too close, they might be aggressive. Mm -hmm. If in case that happens, then we have to make eye contact with the tiger and go slowly oh, okay. back. Don't turn right away. If you turn, they will attack. Okay. They always attack from behind, not from the oh, okay. front. That's the nature of tiger. Okay. okay. Uh, for the elephant, as soon as we see them, we just have to look safety direction and go away. There is uh, nothing to do with a wild elephant. If you climb off a small tree, they will broke yeah. and you can't climb big tree, no. right? So we hope. We try our best to show you more and more things. We hope uh, you will enjoy the walk. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you. I don't have three torch. One, two, three. Oh, it's massive. They went this this direction. They have a three torch. One, yeah. two, three, all around. Uh, this is a one, one foot. Wow. Those are rhino tracks. It's digging from the bear. Uh, I'm looking for termite. <laughs> That's a uh, uh, good print of Wow. wow. Is that fresh? That's a from, from There's some more over there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
Definitely a way to make me shit my pants. Okay, that was exciting. I knew And then he had us maybe. Yeah. So that was a wild one. Yeah. That was a steel, buddy. Oh, is that was that a rhino? That was a rhino. Yeah. Oh. You did it as well. I only saw the back of it. Yeah, it was wasn't facing us, thankfully. <laughs> if it was facing us, it was a rhino. Just taking the water taxi back across the river. There's alligators all around. Don't fall in. Here's a view of my lunch. It's a vegetarian chow mein with egg. Yes, it's full of carbs, but what are you going to do? I haven't actually had pasta in months. And I think I only had pasta once the whole time since about June of last year. It's very good. A little spicy for my, my taste buds. That's all right, we're working on that. Gotta start somewhere. So we're back at the lakeside, getting ready to go back on a boat taxi across the river again. This time we're doing a cheap safari ride for four hours. Our hotel guy is over here trying to get us our permit sorted out. So that's why we're waiting around, but it should be fun. Hopefully we'll see some bears. Would you like to have a good laugh with me? I am at a beautiful restaurant over the looking the river. Silly me decided to order the barbecue fish. Um, I don't know how you eat that. How do I get myself into these predicaments? Huh? I don't want to ah! I don't really want to eat the whole fish. I don't have my glasses on. I can barely see. I think you're supposed to just eat the fish. Here it goes. I can't believe I just ate that. <laughs> I'm going to eat another one. I didn't really want to eat the head though.
It's actually pretty good. I just let my head get in the way sometimes. This is a really big one. There's so many of them. How many can eat all of them? Should we talk about tomorrow? Tomorrow's supposed to be 92 degrees. We're starting off at 7 o'clock in the morning. And we're going to go for another safari walk. Uh, it's an all-day walk. So it's 7 in the morning till I think about 5, 6 o'clock in the evening. We'll be having a lunch prepared um, to take tomorrow. I'm excited. I hope we see some more rhinos and black bears. I'm going to eat some more fish and head to bed, probably go to my room. It's only maybe 7 o'clock. Um, so I need to head back to my room and work on some videos. Ciao!